Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to the farm. Hope everyone's having a good start to the week. It's uh, obviously Tuesday night here where I am in uh, in Canada, but, uh, you know, happy whatever day it is, wherever you are. I decided I wanted to play a little Stardew Valley tonight. Just kind of chill out a little bit, relax with some uh, strawberry planting, since the, uh, the egg festival's coming up in our game, like, momentarily. Uh, it's only like a day or two away, I think, if I remember correctly. Man, look at all the games I have on the go here. Oh, uh, soon Rogue Farm was the one we were working on. Man, <laughs> I didn't realize I'd played this many times in the game. I haven't loaded a game in this thing in, like, forever. Apparently my daughter was playing, too. Uh, well, welcome everybody who's here in the chat so far, or if you're watching on the channel afterwards, welcome as well. As always, a big thanks to everyone who's clicked on that join button to become a channel member. I do appreciate the support, and a special thanks to all our top-tier Mistakes Are Made members that were highlighted right at the start of the stream. Gary the New Man, thank you for the, uh, the two-month member message as well, and for the two months of support. That's awesome. If you're wondering about the music, <laughs> I turned off the in-game music because when I streamed this on Sunday, I had a, a copyright troll make a claim against the video. They don't have the rights to the music. All the music was created by the developer of the game, but they got to claim it anyway. And uh, yeah, so I'm just playing something from Epidemic Sound. I just picked like some random modern jazz or something I think it's supposed to be. I, I don't know how modern it is or how jazzy it is, but uh, I figure for background music or whatever, it'd be all right just to let that kind of trickle along in the background, see how it all goes. So it's a little, a little silly on the intro music or whatever, but whatever. Uh, okay, I don't remember what we were doing, even though it was just the other day. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's uh, day 11. We have to like day 13 to get to the Strawberry Festival. For the, I guess it's the Egg Festival, where we're gonna buy the strawberries, because it's all about the strawberries. We're gonna plant so many strawberries, I'm like absolutely going to, <laughs> going to, uh, excuse me, we're gonna have a hard time watering it all. Got some new items in stock, a deluxe fishing pole and some bait that you can attach to it, uh, blah, 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 blah. Willie wants to teach me to be a master baiter. This thing, I lost my favorite axe. If you find it, please return it ASAP. I'm ha All right, so we know where that is because uh, we played the game before and that's worth 250 gold, which I'm good with. Yeah, so um, I've been like trying to stockpile cash and stuff so that we can uh, have lots of money to spend at the Egg Festival to get everything that I want, um, which is kind of like everything. Uh, <laughs> and so uh, once we have mountains and mountains of cash, then we can buy all the things, plant all the things, water most of the things, because I'm, I'm going to run out of energy before I water it all, I'm fairly certain. Um, but in the meantime, I guess we should water the stuff I already have. What's the death count so far? <laughs> Fortunately, zero. <laughs> Pretty bad if it was failing in uh, death counts on uh, Stardew Valley, I must say. Oh god, no wait, death count one! Cat down! Cat. Oh no, cat's fine. Maple baking us out again. I don't think the cat could actually die in this game if you don't water it, but I think it just, I don't know. I, I don't know what the benefit is of watering it and, and petting it, aside from, you know, making it appear as though you care about your pet. Outside of that, I don't know what effect it has. <laughs> when do the zombies show up? You know what's funny? There is actually a game out there that's like zombies and farming. I almost played it, but then I was like, no, that, that just looks... That looks like something I can't play. It's just, no. Not good. <laughs> it makes you love you faster, but I can already love me f super fast. Me love you long time. I could love myself faster than anyone I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm in a mood tonight, I think. I don't know. No, it's not Plants vs. Zombies. It's something else. It's like a, a Tama... A toma crop or something like that. Maybe they're not really zombies. Maybe they're just like some sort of like radioactive monsters or something. I, I can't remember. It was something like a toma crop anyway. I think that's what the name of it was. So much watering. When we get to the point in the mine where we can get some iron, I'm gonna make the, uh, the the cheap sprinklers, even though it's gonna take like a bajillion of them, just because I feel like I want the opportunity to not spend as much time water. Um, which does make me think that when we're planting the strawberries, I wonder if I should stagger them out as though I'm using sprinklers anyway, even though I don't have them yet. So that when I get the, uh, 
when I get all the fancy metals and things, then I can actually put the sprinklers in without having to dig up the plants before the season's over. But I don't know. Hey Tina Rice, how you doing? Okay. I think I think I watered everything. Put all these away. Oh wait, not, not those. Put this away. Uh, we already turned in the parsnips over at the community center, so I don't have to worry about those. Draft three. Uh, I don't think there's anything else here we need to worry about. I'm, I'm sure, like, I know that you guys were saying but, uh, on Sunday when I was playing that stuff in your inventory will, like, wiggle when you mouse over it if it's in your community stuff you gotta do. But we're still really early on. If you, uh, if you didn't see us playing on Sunday, uh, I started a fresh new game. And, uh... This is still year one, so we're like coming up on, we're coming up on the, um, on the Egg Festival year one right now. So that's why I'm like packing away all the, all the, all the bucks we can get here. Uh, I feel like stuff grew back. <laughs> this is the last time we played. There's even a thing like growing here. Yeah, I literally can't get, okay, you know what? We need, uh, we need some tools. I can't get through down here. The <laughs> organic versus give me do nothing and do called start don't value. Well, you could do nothing if you chose to. I mean, if that was really, a, really the kind of thing you wanted to do, you could, you could choose to do nothing. Game progression might be a little bit on the slow side if you choose to do that, though. I have to guess. It's my sneaking suspicion, anyway. I don't... I don't know if that's necessarily accurate, but I'm fairly certain it is. <laughs> okay. Brew. I'm gonna check for spring onions. Gonna, oh, ooh, kids are playing in the sewer. Ew, it smells. Why does it smell like when dad leaves the bathroom? Why is it locked? I wanna explore the sewers. I think Gunther has the key. Professor Gunther? The man who runs the museum? Why do you think he has it? Who else is gonna have it? Saw a big rusty uh, old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this just has got to be a match for a big rusty old key. Ashley with the super chat. Here's for hoping for five deaths. Good luck. <laughs> yeah, we'll see what happens. Went south from the southeast corner last time, did I? Okay. Alright, it's fine. I dug a way through anyway. We got a, a bit of a clearer path. It should be easier. Get out of here, kids. Rotten. You demand six deaths. We can't stop at five. We must go to six. Alright. We're in. Why do you run? Oh, we got a flower. So... Uh, we're also working on wooing Haley, because wooing is what we do best. Our, this time it's not pocket salads, though, because we're not, we're not wooing Leah, we're wooing Haley, and she likes the daffodils. Probably should have looked up what else she likes. But for now, we'll make do with the daffodils, because I got some of those, we've been collecting them in spring. It wouldn't hurt to have some of those on, on reserve, you know, just kind of in case. Oh, right, the, uh, the hat mouse is down here. Forgot about that. Southwestern, no thanks. Not spending a thousand gold on a hat. This close to Egg Festival. We need lots of strawberry seeds. Sunflower and fruit salad, she likes. Okay. All right. Get some of that. Uh, The axe, I think, is somewhere down here, right? There it is. Bing! You found the lost axe of the Robin person. She was down here murdering people in the woods, and she left it behind. Please return her evidence to her. Don't mention to anyone you found it. This game's actually very dark. Don't like to tell you. Secret. Hey, Ricky. Robin's like, hey kids, wanna go to sleepyway camp? Just go find my axe. Uh, 
Of the farming is tonight? Yeah, you know, I just felt like chilling out tonight. I, uh... <laughs> I was tempted to lay on the couch, and then I was like, oh no, if I do that, I'm gonna miss stream. <laughs> I was like, I'm just gonna, gonna play a game where I can chill out and plant some strawberry seeds and and excessive amounts of time watering. So that's what we're doing. She likes ketchup cake. I saw a picture of that in the Discord. Whoever tries to eat that thing has something seriously wrong going on with them. You may want to seek help. That's all I'm going to say about that. Uh... Well... Put the leaks away, I guess. Well, I can put all this away. I don't really need the scythe on me anymore. I'll leave the pickaxe. I'll take the fishing pole. Maybe we can do some fishing. Take the hoe. Uh, I think I'll sell the nanny lions and then, uh... Yeah. Oh, I should go to the beach, too, actually. See if we can scavenge up anything down at the beach side. Clip that and send it to Rabbit. <laughs> what, the ketchup cake thing? Yeah. Rabbit and his ketchup cake, man, I'm telling you. Oh, uh, I went the wrong way. I need to go see Robin. Need my money. Hey, uh, Brian, uh, you, uh, you got my money? Uh, where's my money, man? I mean, she doesn't give it to us, rough her up a bit. Got her axe. <laughs> what type of cake? Mmm, cake. Oh, but I'm so sweet and tasty. <laughs> this is a weird music mix that's playing on Epidemic Sound. <laughs> Hey, I found your axe. Do you want to, like... No. Do I have to, like, go around the side to talk to you? Hey, you found my axe! What a relief! I almost chopped my toe off with the other one I was using. Thank you. You know what's funny is I have the game music turned off, but in some instances it still plays. Very weird. Maybe it's just like the ambient game music, but when you go into like a building, it's not considered ambient anymore. Strikes me strange. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, I was gonna go to the beach, and then I didn't. Fishing. Go down here. Try to get some, uh... Try to get some fancy... Fish bits. Oh, right in the bubbly spot. Fish is good money, too. Bing! Don't want to alarm anyone, but I got a chub. <laughs> I'm gonna be, like, all over the place tonight. <laughs> Bing! Mmm, delicious carp. Oh. The bubbles went away. Wish we could run in this? Yeah, you and me both. Or if we had like a speed potion or something. There is running, but it's like default run. And then when you hold down shift, you walk. Um, you can actually have it the other way around. When you hold down shift, you run. But you still don't go very fast, regardless. Largemouth bass. I think those sell all right, right? <laughs> a decent amount of money for largemouth bass in this. Need coffee or a horse? I have neither. What if you fed your your uh, horse coffee, or your if you fed your coffee horse? You go twice as fast. Is that Creamer in your coffee? No, his name was Trigger. Eh. Horse and coffee and either crab cake or spicy eel. Uh, I don't even have a kitchen yet, so we won't be making anything. <laughs> Living the bachelor lifestyle right now. All about the uh, the fast food takeout, you know. Largemouth bass equals Karen fish. It's gonna ask for my manager. I ran out of sugar today. And I didn't get around to going out to the store to get any more, so I made my tea with honey, and I don't normally do that, but it's going down really good right now. 
haven't played this game in almost three years. Time to dig through my Nexus mods bookmarks. <laughs> uh, oh, you had it all modded up, didn't you? I have yet to play this game with any mods, and I know there's one that makes it, like, much more extensive. Um, I can't remember what it's called. Something like Stardew Valley, but you're crazy or something. It's not the name of it. Something else. Stardew Valley, but a small Lovecraftian town. Would you play it? 100% I would. Be all over that. Stardew Valley Expanded. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I'm thinking of. <laughs> I don't know the names of things. I barely even know what things are. Oops. I'm not, not trying to fish in the chest over here. Uh, we're going to sell all this stuff because I don't know reasons. I guess I'll hold on to the algae. We're going to hold on to the daffodil because we need to give that to What's-Her-Face. You know, the one we really like so much. What's-Her-Face. Uh, I think I'm going to... If I have... It's 8.10. I wonder if I have time to go all the way down to the beach and do some looting. And get back. Oop. Let's get my money. Give me my money, man. How long did it take you to get 100,000 subs? Just wondering. Uh, I think it was somewhere... Oh, what the? Oh, hey, Linus. Uh, I think it was somewhere in the neighborhood of, uh, seven years. Something like that. But I didn't really have, like, a massive growth phase. It's just been, like, steady upward trend the whole time, so... I did have a bit of a boost when I was playing Fortnite. That was, uh, that was faster growth, but, uh... Yeah. How's it those raccoons are back again, filthy barmans? No, it's Linus, you dummy. Turn another round by. Can you please go shoot those raccoons? Here's my shotgun. I loaded it up with a couple rolls of dimes. That's a great to hear. It gives you motivation. Yeah, the thing is, like, some people get exceptionally lucky and their channel will explode in a very short time frame. Um... For most people, it's a um, luck comes in the form of a lot of work. <laughs> so, um, if you hit on the right trend at the right time and you get a good audience and your content is good and entertaining, um, you know, obviously the higher skill you are at editing and stuff will will make a big difference. Streaming's a bit of a different beast than that, but I'm not even reading the dialogue. I just remember that I, Linus needs me to like do some stuff. I think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? Uh, no, it's a shame for food to go to waste. No, but you should get a job to stop leeching off of others. Let's try to be nice to him. I wanted to, I wanted to befriend him a little bit, so we'll tell him it's not being shameful. Steven, been in the kitchen since the stream started. Have you managed to grab a chub yet this stream? Oh yeah, I got a chub. Got a nice fat chub. I sold it already, but got one. <laughs> That's right, I'm not harming anyone. That's right, Linus, get out of here. I don't want to talk to you. Be nice to you later. You, you can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's can anymore. Tell him you scared off the raccoons for good. Curiosity, how do you look up the version history of the stream date plays? Version 1.3 in April 2019, so actually just over three years. Oh, yeah. That was a while ago then. Wait. Oh, no. Worried. I don't know what you're doing, Linus, and I don't appreciate it. I'm gonna shoot you now. Game's a lot more dark than you thought it was. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone here in Pelican Town to go hungry. If I poison the food, you'll be dead, and then there won't be anyone hungry in town. Bring on the zucchini fritters. Does, does Linus get happy if you give him any type of food, or does he still have, like, certain gift types that he likes? I don't remember. Cause, you know, I have a memory like a goldfish. <laughs> you sell enough chubs to Pierre and his wife will talk about how much they love them. <laughs> really? I need to do that some more. He'd be like, dang, I really love me a good chub. His wife would be like, oh, me too. <laughs> Gotta work hard to get lucky. You've been going for about two years now and it seems like YouTube growth just comes in waves. Love watching your stuff. It does kind of, yeah. There's a, there's a couple things with playing games on YouTube in particular, like... Some of it will come in the form of finding a game that you enjoy playing that also has an audience level that people are interested in seeing it. So, con like, the, the type of game is obviously impactful. Ooh, I got gold ore. Um, 
type of game is obviously impactful, but then also there's like just the the editing and the, your you know, your style or your you know, the way you the way you say the words, you know, the personality type of thing that people come to hang out for. Nobody's searching for your personality, so they'll tend to find you based on what you're doing more than how you're doing it first. But strange bun. No, there's something wrong. What's inside? I'm really, really worried um, that this might be the bun from Van Wilder. Um, because it's got a lot of energy in there. <laughs> Haven't been to the beach in so long. I know, right? I think I'm gonna go to the beach next week. How many mistakes? How often you die? Yeah, it really depends, right? Some people come. Some people come to see, like, uh, they want to see high play skill level or whatever. Other people just want to be entertained. And then sometimes people actually want to learn something, which, you know, they don't come here for, because <laughs> they're smarter than that. PC Day with a member message. 22 months, no less. Oni brought us together. Thanks for the member message, and thanks for 22 months of support. That's crazy. Almost two years. So much good support out there. Level 4 farming, plus 1 water and can proficiency, plus 1 hole proficiency. Iron fence, preserve jar, basic retaining soil. I had 3 hours left? 3 hours what? What'd I do? Oh, you mean before going to sleep. Oh yeah, I guess I, I probably should have done something else like chop a tree down or something. <laughs> not true, we learned what not to do. Oh, well there's that also I guess, so you're still learning something. In general, though, people people come to watch content because they want to be amazed at your skill level or entertained. Perfect for weather. F oh, wait. This is for tomorrow. That will take place in Telecom Town. I'm throwing at 9 a.m. Don't be late. All right. So it'll be sunny-ish tomorrow? Dear Cryptic, tomorrow we're holding the Egg Festival in the town square. That's where we're going to sell lots of strawberries so you can buy too many of them. You should arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. And if you'd like to attend, you wouldn't want to miss on the annual egg hunt. Blah, 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 blah. And just in time, we got a bunch of crops we can sell. Got a lazy cat over here again. I don't want our can. Again, the music kicked in. I turned the music off. There we go. I just don't want to get claimed by some troll. Kind of annoying. I do like the music in the game, but... I tried reaching out to a concerned date, but he didn't respond, so. So I'ma just turn the music off. Gonna go see the trader? Oh, that is today, isn't it? Um, yeah, I probably should, because they sell that, whatever that super seed is, right? We'll go sell these to Pierre, because, well, I guess I could just put them in the, I could put them in the bin. We got money, we got money for those overnight. Look at that. Get the crops and ready to go. Uh, here I guess. Put a watering can away. All right. Oh, <laughs> wait! I put the watering can away. I didn't even use it yet. Sorry, cat. Onto the cat first. It doesn't seem to mind. <laughs> I say, can't tell if it could anyway. It did shiver at one point, but I don't know if that was just like a normal animation or it was reacting to me having water poured on it. Super Seeds 2K for the fall. Okay. Uh, that's going to cost a chunk, unfortunately, but I do want one. As many of the super seeds as we can get, I think, actually. They're the ones that, like, they have, like, super awesome uh, value or whatever when they grow, right? Oh! Out of water. You streamed many games that did well analytically, but you just didn't have much fun playing the actual game. I got a thousand plus subs from FNAF, but uh, I had to take a break on it. It was draining, but did well. Um, 
No, I don't think so, because I, I mostly have focused on trying to find a combination of games that I want to play, and that I think will do well. Um, like I said, I did play Fortnite that, when that came out. Uh, I actually started playing it before the release, because I was playing... Um, I was playing the Save the World version of the game before Battle Royale even existed. And so that came out and I played it. And then uh, it was doing really well. I was trash at the game, but it didn't really matter. People were watching it anyway, and so that was doing well. Um, there was a point at which where I was like, okay, this people are just like completely outplaying me. I'm not enjoying this. It's not really drawing as much interest anymore. I'm just going to let it go. And so I, I guess that's the closest thing. But otherwise, I tend to kind of rotate around a little bit. Uh, survival or coleslaw, hash browns, fiddlehead risotto. Really? I would have tried a fiddlehead risotto. There's a rare seed. It's one thousand. So in fall, takes all season to grow. It's only a thousand, so we'll buy it. Uh, unfortunately, that's gonna cut back on my strawberry purchasing, but probably more important to get that, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, getting over it is a game that I. But I didn't really play that. Because I was getting good growth on it or something. Like, no, it's, it wasn't one of those kinds of things. Dan Keller with the 30 month member message. Evening Fox, how goes it tonight? It's good, Dan. Thanks. How are you? And thank you for the 30 months of support. That's incredible. Can't get over how many memberships there are that have these huge month numbers attached to them. Blows my mind. Uh. What do I want to do? I guess we'll chop some trees down. I mean, I need uh, I need wood, so... Might as well gather some of that with the energy that we have available to us. I saw back when Arlcraft came out. <laughs> oh yeah, I played that a little bit too. <laughs> I played a lot of really random things over the years. I think it's safe to say my game selection over the years has been kind of eclectic. Probably the past year or two, I think I played more survival games than anything else. But I've had like a really big mix of stuff over the years. We thank you, sir, with the top tier content. Well, you did thank me, Dan, when you uh, clicked on the join button and set up the membership. I appreciate that. Uh, I'm stuck. If you're watching any game you love to play, it's easy to tell when you're enjoying yourself. Yeah, I mean, there's been a couple games I played that I, I only played them once or whatever, um, where I didn't wasn't super into it, so I just didn't play them again. There's even some games that I enjoyed that I still only played once because they just didn't really draw much interest. Like, um, there's this one uh, there's this one game where you like rip apart spaceships called Hardcore Shipbreaker. I actually played it a bunch myself off stream. Um, because I enjoyed it. I found it really relaxing and slightly challenging, and it was interesting to play. Um, but apparently it just really wasn't very interesting viewing, so it didn't it didn't do very well, but... Still good. Ashley with a seven-month member message. Here's to another month and a lot more deaths. Love your streams. Well, thanks, Ashley. Thank you also for the, uh, the helpful uh, mod support as well. That's much appreciated, too. Keeping all them ruly people in line. Bunch of ruffians around these parts. Okay, I've uh, I've tapped out all my energy pretty much. I, I could probably eat the field snack, or whatever. But did I pet the cat? Yeah. Heart space is what got me on your channel. Oh, really? <laughs> all right. Well, that's uh, all right. So somebody had an interest in it. <laughs> it's actually a really well done game. For what it is. The the trouble is that it just it's not it's not the most engaging thing to see, I think. Unless you really like that kind of stuff, in which case it's pretty good. I enjoy playing it. Over here, input on your experience on YouTube. Never got to hear your uh, these takes from an experienced person. Now the others uh, unfortunately there are forums that you can join online where you can get lots of input and feedback. Oftentimes by people who haven't gotten much success, unfortunately, so the feedback is uh you no, know, it's sometimes uh, like a, um, a lot of uh, groupthink. But yeah, it's fun. I mean, it's it can be hard work. It's especially hard when you when you work at it for a while. And you don't feel like you're getting any progress. So I should talk to her, I guess. Girls like to talk. 
Okay, no, she doesn't. <laughs> I, you know what? I just don't understand women. Oh, because I already talked to her. She doesn't want to talk to me more than once a week. So she's not like a girlfriend. She's more like a wife. Alex Arnold, member for six months. Might as well throw my piddly streak out here as well. Well, thank you for the support. Six months is still incredible. Any memberships are incredible, to be honest. Because it's, uh, it's entirely optional. Like, people don't have to do it. We'll rob the garbage cans then. Just up to the beach today, because I have no energy to do anything else. It's only 3.20 in the afternoon, my guy wants a nap. I'm going to play DST and Tim soon and check it out the... I actually thought about playing it the other day and then I didn't. Um, I probably should, because I actually like WX. He's one of my favorite characters to play in that game. And I still have nothing down here. Well, your channel with the Oxygen Unincluded runs a couple years back and love your varied selections. I played a lot of Oxygen Not Included for a few years. It was uh, like the primary game that I played. Uh, both because I enjoyed it, but also because it, it had a, a pretty decent following. Such a good game. That's where I'm at. The growth feels slow, but sometimes watching other people stream like yours really inspires me to get back to it. Yeah, sometimes, uh, sometimes the motivation can be challenging, right? And I don't know how how often or how long you're streaming. I, aside from like the last month where I've been really erratic, I normally stream between five and seven days a week. This last month since I got sick, I just my energy level has been like absolutely in the toilet, so I've missed a lot of streams. But, um, I normally stream like five to seven days a week, and only generally about three hours a day, sometimes four. Every once in a blue moon, I might have a, like another stream, like I did on Sunday. I did like an afternoon stream and then an evening stream as well, but that's really not typical for me. But I see like a lot of people that play first person shooter games and stuff, they tend to stream for like eight to ten hours straight every day. That's a different level of commitment right there. <laughs> Eric with the six month member message. Me too, me too. Love you, keep it up. Well thanks, Eric. Appreciate that. I like these member message things they, they have that kind of pop up with the color coding and everything. They're neat. It's nice that they uh have those tied into the membership anniversary kind of things. I'm not finding anything. I wandered all over town to what I find, like a flower? Even that? I might as well just sleep and make it the next day at this point. Oh wait, we could go up to the, um... Oh no, it's, um... Is it this, the spa thing's not open yet, is it? I don't think I can get up there. There's a lot of wooden fiber you're leaving behind. The not like loose stuff though, like I have to chop it and I have no energy right now. My energy is like way down in the toilet. I've got 10 energy left. Oh, it doesn't open till summer. Okay. Well, that's lame. <laughs> Alright, maybe I should just eat something so that I can chop more things. I <laughs> guess. I'll eat my field snacks. I do know I need lots of wood, so I guess punch in the field snacks, drop a tree on your cat. I think should be fine after that. Drink a lot of water and you can do many streams. It's, well, for me it's a function of time. I have a family and everything, so I guess if you're if you're a younger streamer and you don't have, you know, a spouse and kids and a full time job and all that kind of stuff and like streaming's your only job, then you can commit a whole lot more time to it. This is more like a side hustle for me. Get more time, problem solved, yeah. <laughs> What's the other building on the lot? Uh, there's a greenhouse there that's all dilapidated. Uh, we can repair that at some point. But we have to complete things for the community center, I think, to do that. I'd like to get the bridge repaired down to the beach so that I can uh, 
I could loot more beachy things. Uh, 241. I don't know how much wood it takes to fix that thing. I'll have to check. We won't be able to do it tomorrow anyway, because it's the uh, it's festival day. The best of us for the rest of us. I'm going to go to sleep. It's only 9 o'clock, but... Can't wait for egg day. I thought I'd save that ever. 300 for the bridge. Oh man. Now we got the tapper. Spring Island is your best food for spring. Uh, you've been very unlucky with your pickups. I did have one time I went down there, there was a bunch of spring onions and I gathered those. I have a bunch of them in my chest. But yeah, I mean, they're like... It's free, free energy, right? But beautiful sunny day tomorrow. I don't want that, I want rain. Rain. Oh, water can. Oh, son of a. The number of times in this game I've done that. <laughs> but it need that was a weed. It wasn't really a plant. Fine, I was just taking care of the garden, you know. At least I didn't do it with an expensive plant this time. These are just like the wild seeds, so they're not even... Not even that important, really. Any energy to do things at the festival, does it? Like, I can spend all my energy here and not worry about it because I don't need it. Yeah, it's one less plant to water it. Fair enough. <laughs> Wild seeds, that crap might even be legal. Yeah, in, in Canada, it's very legal. That's right, I like to plow through my profits. That's right. What I do. I like to plow all kinds of things. Oh, you know what I haven't done yet that I can do also? Um, I got this whole crafty thing to make the furnace, uh, and I kind of never got around to doing it. Oh, it takes 20 copper ore to make that, that if you why. 25. I got stones. We can do a thing. We can make a stuff. Furnace made. Beautiful. I don't know where to put the furnace. Anyway, we'll stick it back here. Why not? So, <laughs> it took like pretty much all the stuff that I could put in there. Oh, I got no, let's make the, we'll do some copper things. I forgot, how do I put this in here now? Gotta go. Oh yeah, requires a coal. I have two coal. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to get my hands on more coal too, apparently. That's right. Cook, baby, cook. DST brought me here. Yeah. Well, like I said, I've played a lot of different games over the years. <laughs> Probably a wide variety of things that people have caught me and ca caught me playing and ended up over here at some point. I forgot how I ended up here. It must have been the game I or my wife was watching a lot of at the time and YouTube thought we might be interested. Damn you, YouTube. Now we're hooked. That's how we get them. First we get them with the content they want. Then we get them coming back, hoping we'll continue, we'll play the content they want again at some point in the future, but we never do. <laughs> we need, need more don't starve in our lives. Play makes such good games. Better still, they support them over such a long span of time. Great. Penelty, use your furnace to smelt a copper bar. Oh. What are you doing that? I guess it'll give me the reward maybe after I uh, pick it up. Crap love and update tunes sound like. Yeah, they were working on one, so I guess we'll see what happens. 
Uh, okay, I gotta go to the, I gotta go to the egg festival. I don't want to miss out on that. Otherwise, all this work I've been doing to stockpile cash is gonna go to waste. Put all this stuff away. Got my copper bar. Do, 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 do. No. Give me anything. Uh no. Uh. Copper. Oh, it takes two copper per. All right, never mind. Uh, well, we can do a gold one, I guess. Oops, don't do that. Requires five ores. All right, never mind. Fine, be that way. Go to the egg festival. I got 9,179 monies to spend. <laughs> Ooh, got a flower. We'll find what's her face. Probably have a lot more success flirting with her if I can remember her name. Wife, it was Grounded. That's right, I remember now. Yeah, Grounded was actually some of the largest streams I've ever had on this channel. They were like, for a while, there were like 3,500 people watching at a time. That was fun. Maybe not as fun for the, uh, part of peace. Maybe not as fun for the mods, but, uh, it was fun for me. Decorative pitchfork can be placed inside. Who wants to put a pitchfork in their house? Don't understand. On for me. Very see. Um, do I need money to play the games? It's just an Easter egg hunt this time, isn't there? There's like no actual games, right? No one really talks to me. I just came for the deviled eggs. Burp. Put something nice in the punch. I bet you did. He's such an alcoholic. She's, she's drugging. She's feeding alcohol to the kids. Someone arrest that lady. Fried eggs, boiled eggs, poached eggs, deviled eggs, scrambled eggs, chocolate eggs. Hate you, Gus. Evil, evil man. Picture. Can I get... Can you even line this up right? There we go. I wish I could zoom in. Uh, where's Haley? We should talk to... Oh, no! Don't talk to the cool kid! This festival's alright, but I'm really looking forward to is the flower dance. That you are. Try to eat at least three eggs every day. Shut up, Alex. Nobody likes you. That protein for my legs. Yeah, shut up twice. Okay. Is it... It's just the Easter egg hunt and then the party's over, right? So I guess I should just... I should go buy the strawberry things before I forget. Not enough! More strawberries! Alright, we got 91 strawberry seeds. That's probably a good start. How long do they take to grow? I don't remember. Eight days to mature and keep producing strawberries after that. Alright. Uh, alright. Let's talk to, uh, is it Marnie that does it? Oh, the Egg Festival compliments of my wonderful brood hens. Why are they brooding? Into them? No, flamingo! Oh, I should have got the flamingo. Oh, well. What are you gonna do? Even though my bad leg, I never miss a town festival. What, you think they wouldn't accept you because you got a bum leg? How shallow do you think people are? Think everyone's ready for the egg hunt? All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm overcompensating for my secret Alex bromance. Shh, don't tell. I'm terrible at the egg hunt, by the way. This is gonna go great. <laughs> Remy with a two-month member message. I'm really gonna watch hard today. <laughs> well, thank you for the uh, the two months of support. I appreciate it. I love how the little icon says one month, but then it says member for two months. <laughs> Come on, YouTube. Sort things out. Get them to line up a little bit. Time for the highlight of today's festival, the annual spring egg hunt. Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the elusive prize. 
I don't know if I've ever won the egg hunt. <laughs> Is everyone ready? The egg hunt begins! Out of my way, kids! I got one! I got one! I'm in the lead! Oh, wait. Wait and get back here. Bop, bop, bop! Egg, egg, egg! The two! I'm going too slow! I'm going too slow! Gotta go faster! I don't know where all the eggs are. I'm sure there's an optimal path you can run to get like a buttload of eggs in this. Um, but I don't know what it is. So we're gonna go the, uh, the standard cryptic chaotic method. I saw an egg down here. Did. Egg, got an egg. 15 seconds left. We're in trouble. I think, I think we're in trouble. I don't know how many eggs we have to get to win this thing. I know there's like, the one girl always gets like a ton of eggs. 10 was your record? Ah, oh, I only got eight. Psh, screwed. No way that's enough. Look at all these eggs. I've only got get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently. We now have the cleanest town this time. Ha ha ha. Shut up and give me a prize. Now the winner of this egg hunt is... Cryptic. Cryptic Abigail. Stupid Abigail. Stupid Abigail always wins. How many eggs did she even get? Here's your prize, Abigail. Enjoy. Abigail sucks. Thanks for coming, everyone. Ooh, good thing I bought the stuff before I did the egg hunt. Yeah. I don't, how many do you need to win? Is it, uh, is it 10? Does it take 10 to win? Is that what it is? However many it is, it definitely was more than what I acquired. That's the only thing I know for sure. Um, okay, let's get some of these things planted right away. Right away. Should make, actually, wait a minute. I can make fertilizers too, right? How do I make the fertilizer? Pigro times five. Pine tar, I do not. All right, with that. Basic fertilizers made with sap. So let's, we're gonna make strawberries. We need to make good strawberries. I've got sap. And I can make basic fertilizer. Whatever, it's a good start. Doing farming in the dark, it's fine. Oh look, Ethel! It's too late. She'd already been. Okay, there was one spot here I couldn't put the fertilizer down. I, I guess I already did it. Yeah, it's 11.20. I gotta be careful how many I plant here. I'm not gonna have time to water them. I say as I plant too many. Okay, so we'll uh, we'll water these, and then I'm gonna have to uh, I'll probably have to plant the rest of them tomorrow. I guess it's all right because then we can harvest strawberries in, in like two batches instead of like hiring. Instead of like bulk harvesting them all in one day, kind of thing, we can spread it over two days. Ah, water. Waiting for me to uh, pass it on my bed, huh? <laughs> it's fine. Pretty sure I bet the cat. Go to sleep. We did it. You should play Super Smash Bros. If you have a Switch. Actually, I don't have a Switch. Nor a PlayStation. I didn't buy either one of those. Show me rain. Ah, oh, beautiful sun. Nobody likes beautiful sun unless you're on vacation. Coleslaw. Make coleslaw. Does that include strawberries? Because I'm going to have a lot of them. Is it a strawberry coleslaw?
I need to upgrade this watering can, man. <laughs> oh, water. What's the storyline of Stardew Valley? Uh, the basic premise is that, much like many of these games, your uncle or somebody died and you inherited their farm and you decided to move here away from the big busy city in order to have a farm and do farmy thing. Pretty much the story. The rest of it is just things that happen. Matter, Mabel. <laughs> Cat. So pathetic. Like she's been abandoned and abused. Oh, I have 56 more strawberry seeds, um, so those need to be planted too, because we need untold vast quantities of strawberry. -age. That's a technical term. Grandpa didn't die? In my story, he did. Poor Grandpa was working the farm one day. He had his horse hooked up to the wagon. The horse bolted, and the wagon ran him over and cut him completely into four parts. He's buried somewhere in the farmyard, some say. We've never really been able to figure out where that grave is exactly, but every now and then we can hear him wailing, Get off my lawn! Forlorn ghost just won't leave us alone. I need my scythe. This grass is getting a little close. Sort of work. Get out of here. Get out of here. You too. And I really have to cough. <laughs> That's right, we turned him into fertilizer. That's right. It's a genuine grandpa brand fertilizer. Sadly, it tends to grow a lot of crop grass. We don't really know why. It have something to do with his personality. Yeah. Number one, grandpa recommended. Absolutely. No, if we hadn't bought that rare seed, we could have got we could have got ten more strawberry seeds. Man. Uh I need twelve more of these things. We can plant all the strawberries. <laughs> Look at that. Just face. Get any wise ideas. Get off my garden, you cat! Needs you pooping on the strawberries. I'm the way the cat just flops. How much have we got? Seven. That's enough to water the bowl. Probably should eat something, though. Hmm, strange bun. I think I've tasted this before. Look at that cat will plant its own special fertilizer in your garden, probably. As long as at least they, they bury it, you know? They don't just leave it sitting on the surface like some other dogs I know of. Dogs. Put on my lawn. Uh, I want to go with the mine, but I also... How many copper bars does it take to upgrade something? Should go into town and check. 
I know all of you probably know, but I'm gonna go look anyway. The five bars? Yeah, I know I need sprinklers, but I, I don't have the uh I don't have the wherewithal to make them yet. So we have the ability to craft them right here, but I need copper bars and iron bars. Uh, neither of which I have a bunch of right now because I haven't been very far into the mine yet. We've only been like level five. Kind of waiting for a rain day so we could go down there and smack some slimy things upside the head a little bit. Hold on, Grandma. Ooh, what's that? Blazed yams, man, all the good, all the good garbage is outside the saloon. Got Linus, I'm taking it. Mm, 20 copper ore for each furnace. Yeah, we, we made one furnace, but... Upgrade tools. No... Oh, I can buy copper ore? Didn't know that. Paid attention. Not that I have any money, but... Yeah, five. Copper trash can. When trashing an item, uh, you reclaim 15% of the value. No. Oh. Ew. Okay, if we smack some trees, then we can... Oh, actually, um, let's check the social thing. Yeah, the new week has started. Let's go find Haley. We'll give her a, a gold daffodil. Does that make a difference what color it is? Gold or silver or whatever. It's 2.20 in the afternoon. She should be out of bed by now. Her garbage. See what kind of weird and strange things we can find out about her. I can't see her bed, so I can't tell if she's in it, but I don't think she... Also not in the kitchen. Maybe she's hanging out by the park up here. She sometimes likes to wait for me up in the park so she can insult me in, in privacy. Really nice that way. There she is. Hey, I got you a thing. You remembered my birthday. Oh, uh, yes, I did. A absolutely happy birthday. <laughs> I'm impressed. Thanks. I said just so weird. Sometimes I wonder if we're actually related. <laughs> and someone tell me it was her birthday. Actually, I think on Sunday somebody told me her birthday is on the 14th, and I just forgot because I have a memory like a goldfish. Yeah, you're all impressed. I totally remembered it was her birthday. That totally wasn't just random. <laughs> Uh, worked out well. Exactly as I planned it. Exactly. I don't care if you've been mayor for 20 years. Get out of the way of the calendar, you jerk. No one ever runs me. Uh, get out of the way! Alright. Drop some tree. Oh, it's today's Haley's birthday. Thanks, Bugman. Ooh, I almost missed it. If you hadn't told me, I'd have been in trouble. Oh, there's two things right there. Bloop. Oh, another gold one. Nice. Husband material right there. You got it. <laughs> Do something randomly nice, but it just happens to be on the right day. Boom. Bonus points. Um. Well, I mean, it's going to be up before I can actually make money, I guess. Maybe I better, I better sell what little, a few little things I can. Since I've got all my money in the ground right now. Let's chop some trees, get some more wood. Gotta get ourselves a bridge to the beach thing. Oh, and actually, if I uh, gather these things up, we might be able to make some more of the energy food. What do we need for that? Field snacks, acorn, maple, and pine cone. Maple. I knew that. Okay, well, we can make like four of them. Pine cones are the limiting factor right now because I just don't seem to find them all that often. Boop, 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 boop. 
This game's so relaxing to watch. It's also relaxing to play. Funny how that works. He put his boxes in the soup. Then in the produce box. Oh, uh, I don't know. Wait, if you put them in the soup, how can you put them in the produce box if they were already put in the soup? Lots of pine cones when you shop in the southern forest. Oh, okay. Plus those trees respawn too, right? Lumberjack over here. By the way, is it tricky to get the gold star wild plants? Have a full inventory, one slot being the gold star version. As long as that's the only one you have, as you pick up, it will also be gold. Oh. Is that really a thing? I thought before when the inventory slot was. When your inventory slots were full, it just wouldn't let you pick things up. That's cool. Interesting. I don't know. Sounds kind of like an exploit, though. I don't know if we should do that. Uh, does it take money to fix the bridge, too, or is it just wood? If it's, if it's just wood, we're. I think we got enough. We have to pay for it, also. That sucks. If it's not gold, you can't pick it up. But every time you try, it gets a reroll. Oh, that's interesting. Wow, that's sneaky. That's very sneaky. Does it work with farm plants also? Could you get like all gold farm plants by like... That would take forever. That'd be a lot of clicking though. That's right. Doing exploits like that require thinking. I don't do thinking. I do amnesia. I don't, I don't do thinking. Here we got that backpack. Now that we got, now that we got our uh, our plethora of strawberries planted, we're trying to summon the dead beetles. Planted strawberry fields forever. Only where I heard that we're about to work with wild plants. Oh, okay. Interesting. Rock full of exploity goodness. You can have gold ones. Alright. Oh, wait. Do I need some coral for the uh, community center? The thing's wiggling. Oh, it's this thing that does the little wiggly jobby. So just the uh, just the cockle. <laughs> we need cockles. Is any fish? Can you like grab fish in the tidal pool? Or do you have to actually fish for it? Cool if there would. Oh, there's like a starfish there. We got this. Oh, there's a worm down here too. Oop! Fried starfish. What's that guy's name at the uh, thing? I'll be like, hey, Gunter, you want to see my dried starfish? <laughs> He'd be like, I says, pardon. Can't fish in the tidal pool. That boat is not really fishing anyway. It's like... Grave robbery or something. Cradle robbing. It sounds like you need to change your brand. I'll see my dried starfish. <laughs> Just be gentle. No, it's golden color. It's fine. Uh, yeah. Go. Bling. Oh, you got the uh, clammy thing right here too. But ching. Such a good game. Oh yeah, I can play like hours and hours of this game. Tag was playing this game that I, I dropped in on the other day. 
What was it today? I don't know. All the days are kind of blending together. It was like this thing where you're running like a tavern kind of thing. It looked pretty neat, too. Looked like a very busy game. Lots of things to do. Eleven twenty. Sell some stuff. Apparently didn't need this. Well, let me just double check. Wiggly wiggly. No oh, wiggly wiggly. Sell all that stuff. I gotta get a little bit of money. I'm broke. Flat. I'm strawberry rich and and cash broke. Like being ha house house rich and cash poor. No, it's not. It's not tavern manager. It's uh. Tag is, uh, Tagback TV. It's another YouTube channel. Um, shoot, I can't remember what it was called. Somebody in the stream, I'm sure, knows, because they probably saw it. But it, it's like you're running this tavern where you gotta, like, make foods and cheeses and booze and serve all the people and kick out the rowdy ones and... <laughs> Travel's Rest. Yeah, that's what it was called, I think. That sounds right. God, another sunny day tomorrow. When's the rain gonna come? Salmonberry season all across the countryside. Bushes are teeming with juicy little berries. And they're free for the taking. Oh, look, Ethel. It was too late. Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I'm going to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your crops will all die out. Plan ahead. Sure. Grab all. A little bit of watery water going on. Oh, I guess I should deal with the cat first. Welcome, buddy. Drink up. I don't give you any food, apparently. All I do is water you. They so might as well drink your fill. Rain will only come when you install sprinklers, right? We had, uh... I played on Sunday. We had a period of, like, three days in a row where it rained. It was great. And it hasn't rained since. Listen, cat, I swear to God, if you're if you're going to the bathroom on my strawberry bush, get the boot. Just wait till your cat eats a good fur that comes to grow your crops. <laughs> That'd be great. Oh, you know what? I didn't even look at how many days I was going to have to grow the strawberries. Uh, I planted half of these on day 14. It took eight days to grow. Ah, crap. Look, I got one harvest out of these things. Like, day 28 is the last day of the month, right? Some of them I planted on day 13. So even those I'm not going to get a full two harvest out of. It's going to be like... A day short of the one and like two days of the other. One harvest. I mean, it's still it's still good money. It's just not as good as it is in subsequent years when you get like multiple harvests of it. You get three full harvests out as long as you plant it at the beginning. Oh well. We need to stock up on lots of strawberry money so we can go crazy with the blueberries. Eight days with four day regrowth. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. So I'll get like two harvests out then, I guess. If it's only four days to regrow, that's cool. I think I need to keep some of the strawberries too to be able to turn into seeds for the next spring season, right? Is that a thing? I'm just imagining that. It sounds like something I would make up. Okay, we can take the uh, take the chocolate starfish down to what's the face. Always keep ten yourself for seeds. Oh, okay. Planting watering simulator. Welcome to the planting watering simulator. Oh, and the uh, and the berry fetching simulator too. Don't do that. There we go. Oh, no, 
don't need the salmon berry. Just pick the stupid flower. Get all the salmon berries, man. All the salmon berries. Keep the artifacts of the game with it. Well, I mean, I don't have much else to do at the moment other than chop down a bunch of trees. I'm broke. Uh, I mean, I guess we could go into the mine, but I spend so much energy with the watering and stuff right now that it's not like I'm going in there with an overabundance of energy. Is there any benefit to breaking this rock and clearing out all the weeds in here? Is there stuff that spawns in there that's actually worth getting? Or is it just, uh, would that just be a waste of time? There's all the salmon berries, man. I'm gonna check as long as I was up this way, but... Uh, do I have salmon berries for the... Nope. That for the community center. Southern Forest, north of the mountains, train yard, year two and later. What? Donate to the museum. Here you go, Gunther. Now you can look at my dried starfish all day long. <laughs> oh, God. Fun fact, you can put a horse by the ice cream stand to serve you ice cream anytime. What? What ice cream? Otherwise, there's lots of bushes. Yeah, I figured I'd check the beach out and stuff here. We'll go. We'll head back that way on the uh, the way back to our homestead. Oh, my home that is strange. Ooh, a sea urchin. Nothing useful for the community center. We can sell it. Tribal Strizer. <laughs> this music playing right now, an epidemic sound in the background has got like an almost like a cartoon uh, mystery kind of sound to it. Oh, what are you doing here? Haley's too involved with their cameras to notice you. She's taking selfies. I mean, I'm sure she's pretending she's taking pictures of the river, but she's really doing selfies. You know it. I know it. Everybody knows it. I want to go look for onions, but my inventory is kind of full. <laughs> if I find more than one type, I'm going to be like, Duck. All them berries, man. Hey, what are you, how you doing? How's Buzz? Berries, little behind the streams. Did he finish Planet Crafter? Uh, I did. I could have kept playing it, but there wasn't really much left to be done other than like trying to get to the bug phase. Oh, come on! One time I have a full inventory to come down here. There's a bajillion onions. All right, I'll go take some stuff back and then come to get the onions. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, you're gonna need the sea urchin for the notice board for the community center. All right, well, I'll stick it in the chest for now, then. Yeah, 
guess I could avoid selling it for now. Berry. Berries. All your berries are belong to us. So I can sell it? Alright, whatever. Is that for one of the boards that I don't have open yet? To the community board, right? Oh, yeah, I've only got three of them right now. I need spring, summer, and fall crops for the pantry in the community center. Well, so... Oh, right, I gotta plant some, some actual real crops for things. <laughs> I have a potato. Somewhere here I have a potato. There's the potato. Probably plant those other crops. It's the 15th right now. Probably flower takes, what, 12 days to grow? So I actually need to plant it today. Uh, it's 540, I'm not gonna be able to. Ah, son of a... Ola. I try growing it tomorrow. I'm not gonna buy a bunch of it though, I'm just gonna get like one, because... I've already screwed the pooch on that one, there's not much point in pushing it. 13 days excluding current day. Oh, yeah, so screwed. So screwed! I thought it was 12 days for cauliflower. Well, crap on the cracker. Rules out that one. Most efficient Stardew player ever. <laughs> speed grow. Oh, yeah, speed grow my work. How do I make the speed grow? Wait, can I buy speed grow? Does, does Pierre sell speed grow? I'll have to check it when I'm looking for seeds. I definitely... Oh, I just threw out a clam. But I don't have pine tar anyway. There was something else I was going to do. And I forgot. Because, again, I remember like a goldfish. It was a thing that I was going to do. And involved stuff. Oh, yeah. The onions. <laughs> Go get the onions. That's what we're doing. God. I think I'm suffering from old timers already. 12 days to grow cauliflower without speed grow. Yeah, so like tomorrow's day 16, so if I don't get the speed grow, then... Stand no chance. No chance. Because it would like roll into day 29 or whatever and before it was ready to harvest, and then it would already be dead. That would be suboptimal. I mean... Squirrel! <laughs> Ooh, man, now we got all the onions. Old Fritz brain moment. It's not a moment. It's permanently like that. I'm telling you, I'm suffering from old timers. Not new here. It changed your name. Okay, well. Welcome back, then, Woody. Love chomping and mining energy. It is. Let's do some choppy chopping. Huh. Ash. All this stuff. Whoops. Start selling speed grow on the 15th for 100 gold each. Oh, good! Alright, sweet. So we can get some tomorrow. I guess it makes sense for the latter half of the season you want to rush a bit more. We're rushing. Not rushing, you're rushing. You don't need a JoJo membership to shop at the Mart. The membership gets just gets a discount. Oh. I have a lot of spring onions. <laughs> kind of been stocking them up a little bit. Uh, let's make more of the fancy, fancy bar thing. Field snacks. No reason not to have more energy. 9:20 p.m. 
Maybe we eat some spring onions, we can chop some more trees down. I'm sure there's a faster way to do this than one onion at a time. The onions really don't give you a lot. Uh, we already did the five gold turnips. We did the regular turnip. Um, so some of the things have already turned into the community center, but... Uh, not everything, obviously. So in the uh, in the pantry, we've got... I gotta do these spring crops. Uh, I haven't done any of the artisan stuff, of course. So the quality crops that... Or I did the parsnips already. We've got melon, corn, and pumpkins or whatever. I've done those, obviously. Uh, these are the summer crops. Fall crops. Animal bundles. All these things I haven't done yet. Uh, fish tank. I've gotten a couple of random fish and I've dropped those in. Nothing crazy. A few things. And then the craft room we completed the one, of course. And then we've got some, like, exotic things. we got the winter foraging. Summer forging. It's really there's no spring forging. Oh, I guess that's what this one was up here. Construction bundle. And uh, fall forging. Plum, 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 plum. We got a membership. It locks the community center and puts you down the JoJo route. Oh, we don't want to go JoJo route. I am not a fan of JoJo Siwa. We don't want to go that way. Gonna do it. Heard enough of it when my kids were into JoJo. Hi, my first stream with you. Well, welcome, Carly. Stop eating my profits. They're onions, man. Spring onions don't sell for much anyway. I might sell the gold ones, but the uh, the regular ones, we don't need to worry about those. Fall asleep before you finish. There we go. Chop a chop a chop. All right, more tree wood. Wood. Yay, corns. Uh, I'm gonna sell the gold just because I'm curious what the gold spring onions sell for. We'll sell those. Inquiring minds want to know. So do mine. But up, but up, onions are disgusting and make my stomach hurt and give me a heartburn. Ooh, I like onions. I wouldn't just like sit and eat an onion, but I mean, I like green onions. Twelve gold a piece for spring onions. So <laughs> they're really not—they don't really sell for a lot, but you do find them in multiples, I guess, which is all right. But for the three spring onions I sold, still less than one wild horseradish. <laughs> Not really the most, uh, most profitable process there, but that's okay. That's okay, it's okay. Hey, I'm not 70, man. <laughs> I got an achievement. I, don't, I didn't even see what it was, but I got a, I achieved something. Game said so. I some good humor today. Um, where can I see my achievements? Achievements. There we go. Fisherman, catch 10 fish, earn 15,000 gold. Wow, we got 15,000 gold already? All right. What's going on here? Dear neighbor, hope you're feeling settled in your new home. I'm ready to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? All made 100% pure Pierre crap. Sign Pierre. Sure. God does a dookie in a box and knows you want to sell it to me. All right. I'll buy it. Curious. Got me intrigued. Wait a minute. Do I have cauliflower planted? This looks an awful lot like cauliflower right here. I think I must. I think I got cauliflower as a reward. So I. I do have cauliflower planted. <laughs> All right. We don't. We don't need to rush the cauliflower. We got some. 
And it wasn't a wild seed that I accidentally destroyed with that axe. It was a cauliflower plant. That's funny. I think we got it as a reward from Gunter or something. You got the need more deaths achievement. Oh, Ashley, that sounds about right. What? I do still need green beans. You are correct. We got to plant some green beans. How do you set up the trellis for the green beans? Is that something I have to craft? Or does it just automatically form the trellis when you plant it? I don't remember. Now you have to pee. I can't imagine why with that watering can sound. <laughs> it's like... Designed to make you have to run to the bathroom. Like, oh, that's good. <laughs> when he's all done watering, you just hear zip. Trellis comes with the plant. Okay, good. That sounds like it caters to my laziness in perfection. Much water. I checked the weather channel, right? Did it say it was going to be beautiful and sunny again tomorrow? Because if so, that sucks. I need some rain, man. Definitely, definitely need some rain, man. That looks dead again. <laughs> hey, Rabbit, welcome. Welcome back from the work thing. Oh, work. Oop, it's gonna pounce. Pouncing cat. Okay, our plethora of crops have been waterfied. Now refilled. I'm gonna do a thing now? What was that thing I was gonna do? Oh yeah, Pierre's. Ooh la la, Pierre. Berry bush. Can't let the salmon berries get away. Oh, wait a minute. As long as we're going to town, I should probably bring another flower for Haley. Otherwise, I'm going to forget. Flower for the Hailmeister. Make sure to check the fortune teller on the TV. I did check and I don't remember what they said. Whose birthday's next? A person's. I don't know. I'll have to check the calendar. I feel like Dr. Deathwish is a little behind on the stream. <laughs> He's like, that's cauliflower! What? Oh, there she is. Hey, baby, how you doing? I wonder if any nice shells washed up on the beach this morning. Uh, I don't know, but have a flower. <gasps> Gasp! For me? Thank you! Oh, look, we got three hearts now. Things are accelerating quickly with Haley. Be at first base in no time. <laughs> first base with Haley is she lets you talk to her. Two days before your fave person Pam's B-Day. Ooh, what do we get Pam? Do we get her some alcohol? Welcome to Pierre's. How can I help you? That's a vampire. Oh, that's the Joja Mart guy. Ahem. Come and get 
it, folks. Coupons for 50% off your purchase at Jojo Mart. 50%? Do you have a backpack over there? Well, let he take us. My god, everyone's going to get a coupon. There, there's no loyalty in Stardew Valley. Zero loyalty. All right, I need a uh, bean starter. They take 10 days. 10 days is mature. We keep producing after that. They grow on a trail us. Um, I mean, I guess if I'm going to plant them, I might as well plant a few, right? I've got like eight of them. Ten of them. Um, and then... A starter, sugar, wheat, flour, rice, oil, vinegar, basic fertilizer, speed grow. Increases growth rate by at least 10%. So something like 10 days to grow, it's only going to get like one day shorter. <sighs> I mean, that's not really that big a deal, I guess. We're only going to get one harvest out of the beans anyway. One way or another. No, no sense uh, spending money to speed it up. Stuff. Potatoes. So we'll have any wheat. Blah, 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 blah. Kale seeds. Six, six days of mature harvest with a scythe. Does kale sell for much? I've never grown kale in this game, I don't think. Tulip bulbs. Planted in spring. Take six days to produce a colorful flower. Assorted colors. Days to make flowers, huh? Yeah, whatever. Fine. We got our strawberries. Need potato too for the community center. I have one potato already, so we should be okay on that front. Planted a bunch of potatoes earlier in the season, um, before the egg festival. Then I kept one after I sold the rest. Kale's pretty good. Give you two fertilizers or two harvests if you put fertilizer on the beans. It takes ten days to grow, so if I if I use it, it'll be nine days. So the first day of growth would be the seventeenth, so it'd be the twenty sixth before it's ready. You get to harvest every day. It take if it takes three days to regrow, then I don't think that works. Unless my math is wrong, which is also possible. Um. Should get it set on the last day. Oh well. Not super weird about it, I guess. Not all about the min maxing, I suppose. The only thing I wanted to do was make a ton of money in advance of. Uh, in advance of the eggs festival thing, so I could get uh, I could get that going. The whole strawberry business. Strawberry fields forever. Okay. Everything's planted and prepared for the spring harvest thing for the community center. Three times seven equals twenty-five. Everyone knows that. Growth fertilizer is not worth it for perpetuals like beans, blueberries, etc. In my opinion, oh really? Did I water the cat? Oh, hold on. Not sure. <laughs> oh my God! We killed him again. <laughs> Yeah, cat's good. Perfect timing. Just as I poured the water on him, he just collapsed. All right. Uh, I guess we'll get more wood for the community center. Three twenty p.m. I guess we, we could even potentially go to the go to the dungeon and try to get a couple levels in there. I'm so mean to my cat. No, I was helping her bathe. I was saving her uh, unnecessary tongue friction. 
It was actually very conscientious of me. Very much. Blazed yams. 200 energy out of those things. Really? Go on a little adventure. We might, we might only get like one, one or two into the dungeon or whatever. I don't know how long it takes. Sort of depends. Yeah, look at all this. Got cornucopia up here. Also, one of those horn things that are full of all the food product stuffs. Yeah, we got a decent chunk of... Oh, the strawberries. Yeah, yeah. We got uh, a 91 of them I planted. 91 strawberries. That's right. Fruit of the loom. That's what it is. It's fruit of the loom. <laughs> oh, I went the wrong way. Bing! Level 5. I need a better sword. This sword sucks. I have to kill slimes for the uh, Ventures Guild too, I guess. So I suppose this is working in, working towards that objective also. Ow! Ow! He's hitting me! Ow! Ha! Ah, blocked. Oh! <laughs> I blocked him and he hurt me anyway. Okay, Brute, we need that for the community center. Two geodes? Nice. This sword is super powerful, man. <laughs> Those things stack. Bone sword. I got a, all I have is a rusty sword right now. I can't get into the adventures guild yet because I haven't killed enough slimes to prove myself. We're working on that. Oh god, my inventory is full. Uh, all right. Eat that, get the bug bits. Hmm, bug bits. What's this? Uh, eat sap. No, uh. Trash the sap. Didn't even trash it. That's fine. Fairly common, still prized for its beauty. I wonder if I should just get rid of the topaz. I think we've already given one to Gunther, so we don't need to take it to the the museum. Come on, where's the opening? What I need! There it is. Hello, slimes. Ah! Ah! Oh god, I can hardly move. Got me with this evil slime strategy attack. this up, I guess. Shoot. Um. <laughs> I want the bug meat. I guess I'll get rid of the stone. I gotta get that backpack, man. I need I need way more carry capacity than what I have. Level 10. Ooh, chest! <laughs> I 
literally can't even. I can't even pick up the. All right. Fine. Be that way. There. Okay, we can put the boots on. Now I can pick my horse radish back up again. Bing. Breeze Barry with a 24 month message. I don't know why, but I've uh, been stuck okay 13 months for the past three months, so I'm gonna just drop this here and say happy 23 months, I think. It's actually 24. It says on your message, it says one year because you haven't hit that two year for whatever reason. You must be close. So it's funny, the member message rounds up, but the annual counter doesn't. It's, and it's kind of weird. Anyway, thank you for the uh, 24 months of support, Reads, though. I really appreciate it. Thanks for coming to hang out on the stream tonight as well. Okay, so Cape Carrot, I gotta take to the community center. I've already taken a bunch of this stuff to Gunther, so we don't need to do that. 10 10, we got time. Theory. Where's the way to the community center again? How do I get to the community center, man? I don't know where I'm going. We're not getting leap months, that's right. <laughs> Oh, there's a flower there I could pick if I actually had room in my inventory. You remember messages stuck on 13 months. Oh. Yeah, that works. Okay. Uh, not quality crops. Not that. Not that. In the wrong room. Boop. There it is. Cave carrot. Exotic foraging bundle. How exotic. La la. Thanks for giving me at least 24 months of great content. Well, thanks, Reeds, for enjoying it. Thank you to everyone who's been a supporter of the channel. I really, really appreciate it. As I said before, I, I, I appreciate that it's a completely optional thing, but people still choose to do it, and that's awesome. And then everyone who just happens to show up and enjoy the content, because I know not everybody's in a position to do the whole paid membership thing, and that's cool too. All the support is appreciated. This monthly support on PC only. Uh, here we have super chat only. No, so there's um, there's super chats. There are um, like memberships. You can click the join button or whatever. Um, I don't know about. Uh, I don't know how it appears on mobile. I've never really looked, to be honest. So it's a, it's a bit of a mis mystery to me. A busy town mystery. Pretty sure I needed that quartz for something. Whatever, we'll get rid of it. I need that stinking quartz. I gotta get my hands on some more coal. Dudes, bug meat. Sword can go away. More of that fancy copper stuff. Need one of those coal. I think there's a coal maker we can get later, right? Don't have any join link there. Oh, okay. Is this core keeper? <laughs> yes. Well, yes, yes, it is. <laughs> Not exactly. So the quartz sells for 25 a piece, the amethyst was 100, and the topaz was 80, and that's alright. I'm fairly certain we could keep those things and do something with them later, but I'm more of a, like a instant gratification kind of a guy. So I just instantly gratified myself. Beautiful sunny day again tomorrow. Man, the weather, I'm telling you. If you guys are good humored today, I think you'll have a little extra luck. All right, so we can go to the blacksmith today. We can take the geodes and oh, what's this? We got mail. Dear Cryptic, it's been so long since I heard from you, dear. Things are the same as ever back home. I miss you very much. Love, mom. Yes, found an envelope with some grandpa money left. Uh, some money grandpa left for you. Not 500 gold. A ching. Did I already add it up. I guess I did. Oh, I'm two slimes short of like meeting my initiation. Built a coop yet either. That stuff. Good. 
good. Very good. Eat? No, don't eat the daffodil. No, that's really awkward. Just... Oh my god, would you stop? Okay, it seems that it doesn't work with these crops. <laughs> Unless it's just gonna give me that message over and over. Weird. Alright, uh, gold flower, not so gold flower. The rest of the stuff I'm gonna sell. I could make more of the wild seeds, but I just don't care. I'm just gonna sell them. I don't know how long they took to grow, but it seemed like a really long time. Oh, I got a bunch of flowers for what's her face. Speaking of which, uh, how does it say we haven't talked to her yet? That's weird. I know I talked to her. She told me to buzz off. That's how I know. Oh, I knew it was true love. Just played Oregon Trail ever play? Of course I played Oregon Trail. Classic. Did you die of dysentery? Oh, this uh, horse ranch is right here too. One of my favorite games when I was younger was on the Commodore 64. This game called Defender of the Crown. It's like this game where you had like a castle and you had to like expand your territory and control other places and you could do like jousting and sword fighting to attack other castles. It was super ghetto sword fighting because it was the Commodore 64, but you could do it. The jousting was great. Probably wouldn't hold up now if I played it again. <laughs> well, like horseradish? I do, yeah. I don't have it very often, but I do like it. I don't generally go for like the insane, like incinerate the inside of your nostrils kind of horseradish, but uh... Missed the strawberry? Oh, I did right there. Thank you. Put him in an expensive mistake. Strawberries are like red gold. I have not played Harvest Moon. My first introduction to the whole farming game thing, well, like this anyway, aside from Farming Simulator, was uh, Stardew Valley. Strawberries are all watered. Now, John Lennon will return. I gotta get that, um, cycler machine thing. Take that yet? Furnace, bee house. Alright, the answer would be no. I get it. Music is back. I turned off the, uh, I turned off the in-game music. I'm just playing Epidemic Sound. It's uh, pretty quiet in the background, so you, you may not hear it all the time. Uh, but since I got a copyright claim on the stream on Sunday from a copyright troll, decided not to use the in-game music today. Instead, I've got like some weird, like, disco-y kind of music going on. I don't know. <laughs> it's that jazz, but it's, uh, it's not sounding all that jazzy. The call, man. We 
We're gonna name my kitty the game. I've named my cat Maple, the same as my cat here that is like, oh! Oh no, never mind. <laughs> Whew, thought I actually did something wrong there. Um, named it Maple after the cat that I have at home here that's like crazy attached to me. Not having music won't stop the copyright trolls. Well, it does for certain things. It'll stop for music copyright. Copyright matching is a funny thing. Like, picks up on music more than other types of things. Music and cutscenes in particular are bad for that. Uh, I don't know my site. But... All that, I got one piece of coal. <laughs> I need a better way to get coal. And then we killed the poor kitty. Yeah, well, a couple times we pet the kitty and it didn't respond in a, in a way that I thought it would. It did look like we killed it. Uh... Oh, on me, I guess that's good enough. I'm gonna go, uh, let's go visit the blacksmith. We'll open up these geodes and see what we find in there. Maybe we'll find coal in there. That'd be handy. <laughs> be gentle petting the kitty. <laughs> uh, so many jokes, so little time. Yeah, it's got, well, it, we, it, you say it's got eight lives, but we poured water on it today and it dropped dead also, so... I don't know, it may be down to like seven lives. Haley lady. Oh, Haley. Here today. Maybe she hasn't left her house yet. Kind of lazy. Berries. Ooh, two berries that time. Zero deaths so far today. Zero deaths. All professional gameplay today. Oh, I want that. I like snacky things I find in the trash. Oh, the double berry. Your favorite Jerry Lewis movies, The Nutty Professor. Okay, process geodes. We got a lot. We got enough money. We should be. We'll smack a few of these. Copper, nice. Whatever that is. Petrified slime. Calcite. All right. No, see, aren't dying so often on Icarus Cruise Box. You developing skill? No. I've got armor on now. It's harder for me to die. <laughs> Skill. Don't insult me with your skill talk. What? Oh, I must have read the sign. I was like, I thought I clicked on the door and I was like, what, what do you mean he's not open? He's open right now. Supposed to be. Alright, calcite, petrified slime, new reward. Yes. What I got? What I got? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Melon seeds. Those are for summer. Nice. Yeah. He let me hold his melons. That was a little weird. I have no idea what this clay is used for. Arguing politics on Facebook just to feel people's blood pressure rise. Oh my god, you're one of those. <laughs> I do that on, uh... On Twitter instead. I think I posted my biggest tweet ever today in terms of like the number of tweets all at once. <laughs> oh crud. Um well I guess we need this. What's a gold one? Let's see if this strategy works here. 
Inventory full, inventory full, inventory full. It's not, it's not giving me what I want. Does it not work with coral? Does it only work with plants? Because <laughs> it's not, uh... That trick isn't working here. Son of a gun. How many biomes in this game? Uh, I don't know, there's desert, forest, beach. I think that's it. <laughs> there's like weird island thing. Found a lost book and on the plus side, I don't need any room in my inventory for it. Well, you know what? I could sell the coral to Willy, right? Willy will buy my coral. Ah, Willy! Thank crab pot. I could put an oyster in there. Put an oyster in the crab pot. Um, if he's out here fishing, does that mean I can't s jerk? I need a. F oh, he just closed. Oh well. A character in MMO named Childish Troll. It was fun trolling and, <laughs> and frequently with him. Oh, the trolling. It's used for making silos. Okay. Roots. Blah, blah, blah. There are worms. Worms. Roots don't wiggle. It's possible I got patched since you played. I guess maybe. Maybe coral doesn't count as plants. I don't know. It only works with the, the actual plants. Coral! Coral, I forgot to stop at the community center. Little guy, maybe a hundred thousand years old. Wait a minute. We got another petrified slime? I realized I had two of them. Alright. I'm sell it. I don't need to keep no stinking slime. Put that away, put the flowers away, put this away. Uh I guess I'll go back to the community center. We got we don't have a ton of time right now anyway. Or a ton to do, I guess. Walking Dead, Carl. <laughs> ah, hey, Willy. Good old Alf. Terrible programming at its best. My youngest daughter's been watching old Full House episodes. They've been on like Netflix or something. She's just been like devouring them. Like, oh my god, she found something more wholesome to watch than some of the YouTube stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's not it's not the Full House reboots. They're the original ones. She uh, she tried Fuller House, which is the reboot. She didn't like it. She liked the original ones when the because they were all the kids, right? She's nine. She's she likes the kids. But I was like, you know, it's way better than her sitting and watching Sniper Wolf for hours on end. Or various other really loud and obnoxious YouTubers. <laughs> Man, I really need to get my hands on more coal. Do I have a coal maker machine? Like something I could just shove some wood in to produce coal? Oh, I need my axe. Chop some more things. Oh, 
Oh shoot, I meant to pick the pickaxe and I forgot that. Oh, we got wild seeds. Plant them and see what grows, but I, I'm very curious how long it takes the random seeds to grow. Plant on day 17. I'm gonna forget that I did that. Yeah, I know we unlock one later. I just, uh, I could use one now because I'm kind of... Oh, there's coal. I need, uh, I need coal to keep smelting copper so that I can upgrade something. Be nice to upgrade a watering can or something while the next rainstorm hits. If and we can. Choppy choppy. Yeah, more cool. Getting dark out. You can just dot my farm with torches, so regardless of where I walk, it's like lit up at night. A certain type of stone in this game that gives coal more frequently than others because I noticed there are a couple different looking ones. Step one, get married. Two, have a bunch of children. Step three, have them work the coal mines. Oh, why didn't I think of that? My kids have been having it easy. and put them to work in the coal mines at all yet. Spoiling them. Be bad and sand will give you coal. <laughs> but it's only spring. We need it before the, uh, before winter comes around. Okay, that um, taps out my copper too, so I really need the rain to come so that I can have a reason to go down in the mine and spend a whole day in there. A little -da! charcoal kiln after all that. Are you kidding me? Uh, new graphic recipe wild speed seeds for the summer. We got axe proficiency, wild berry harvesting, plus one. Here comes the sun, doo -doo -doo -doo. Here comes the sun, oh, I see. We got a decent amount for the, uh, the wild seeds or whatever. All right. We got money. We got all the monies. All the monies, it is the monies. Uh, and show me rain tomorrow, show me rain. Partially cloudy with a right breeze, expect lots of pollen. Oh, come on! Welcome back. Listen, uh, refreshing rain, a farmer's best friend. When it rains, you don't have to water the crops. Use this to your advantage. I'd love to, but the weatherman won't cooperate with me. It's like some weird conspiracy he's got going on. These worms. Hanging out right here. What do they think they are? Cloudy with a chance of meatballs, that's right. <laughs> oh yeah, my favorite thing in real life is pollen. Absolutely. My allergies, thank you. I think later in the game you can force the weather. 
do like a rain dance or something. I mean, once you have sprinklers, the, the, the rain... The rain doesn't matter anymore. You can just do whatever. But until you get to that point... It's not raining. You gotta work the farm. That is less than optimal. Especially if you're lazy like me. Should actually go down, go down to the mine again and see if we can get some more copper. They don't have enough to smelt another bar. Timothy with a three-month member message. Hi from freezing Queensland, Australia. 25 degrees. Is that, uh... I assume that's 25 Celsius you're talking about right there? That doesn't sound freezing to me. I... A for 25 degrees. We're having the coldest spring in on record here in Southern Ontario. Or at least we're very close to it. I think we were like a day or something away. I'll have to wait and see if we actually hit it. It's been very dreary. Cold like every day. More like March weather or something. Like the other day, it was like two degrees out or something. Celsius. <laughs> Celsius <laughs> with the shades. Yeah, I'm jealous now. The only thing I'm not jealous of is that you're in a land where there's so many insects that would like to eat your body. So I'm not super jealous because uh, I'd rather did not have my soul devoured by an insect. I'm gonna have to pee so bad when the stream is over. <laughs> There's this constant watering sound. On. Okay, another full set of crops done. Okay, it's 10 a.m. I think I'm gonna head off to the mine today. See if we can get our hands on some more copper. Cause we... uh, I'm not gonna bring the axe. Don't need the copper bar. I do need the sword. Don't really need the scythe. Need the pickaxe. We use. We just need the berries if we need them. Today was 22 degrees Celsius. Tomorrow will be 31. Nice. Looking forward to going to Florida next week where it'll be uh, nice and warm. I assume. Being Florida and all. Been in the bathroom twice since I started the stream due to the watering can. <laughs> uh, I believe it. Don't worry about being eaten by insects. It tastes better than that. What? Oh, they have better taste than that. Uh, I hope I actually read it properly. Way less confusing when I read it right. Florida's rainy cough. Yeah, but it's the warm rain, you know? <laughs> uh, I should get the backpack. Actually, that is a good idea. Uh, I have enough money for it. Let's go grab that before we go in the mine. Just with the super chat. Love this game. Haven't played it in years, but because of you, I started a new playthrough today. Keep up the awesome videos. Thanks, Justin. Yeah, I hadn't played it in a long time either. And on Sunday, I just I had some time in the afternoon, and I was like, I want to play it just a chill game to relax. Not the most uh, in-demand game, but uh, but you know what? I'm just gonna chill out. I had fun. So was, tonight, I was like, you know what? I, I feel like I feel like not working my brain again. Just relax. Here we are. Bring your own poncho and snuggle in food. How about I snuggle in food? That's weird. 24 slot backpack. Ka ching Okay. I can carry things in my bag. Yeah, there are days I work my brain. I do it at work all day long. That's why I can't do it later. <laughs> at the end of the day, I'm like, you know what? I'm done. I spent... Oh, God. I spent six hours between yesterday and this morning 
trying to do like forensic accounting on this set of like four spreadsheets to try to find the one number that was coming out wrong <laughs> to find the source of it my brain almost melted out my ear worst thing ever still forgot the new lever of the TPS that's right I did forget the, the I always use the wrong cover letter on the TPS reports I get in trouble for that all the time now they've asked me to go ahead and come on in on Saturday Timothy Dupree with the super sticker. Thanks, Timothy. One day I'll get to play Stellaris or Dyson Sphere Project, them genius level games. Genius level? Oh, we can't be playing those. Ain't no genius. Do a rock at him. It's a big rock. Alright. Where's the ladder? Give me the freaking ladder! There it is. Energy before we go down there in case there's a bunch of bugs. Why you talk so fast, laugh out loud? I don't know. Habit? I talk like I talk? Used to work for a forensic accounting firm. Oh, Michael. That is not a job I could ever hold down full time. <laughs> it's bad enough trying to find my own mistakes, never mind other people's. Good lord. What you talking about my mother for? My mother's a nice lady. Ooh. More cave carrots. Cole, we needed that. Words to, words to my mom's. Listen, if you're staying overnight at my mom's house again, make sure you take your stuff home with you this time. Empty. For the record, by the way, my mom is 70, so, you know, something to be said for taste. <laughs> but da -da -da -da. Journal updated. I killed enough slimes. I'm now the slime master. Got me. Got me, man. When she takes out her dentures. Woo wee. <laughs> That's right, man. Ow. That's right. Die, you little crabby thing. Bing. Level 15. Women's lingerie. Level 16, men's lingerie. I'm gonna try Dyson Sphere Project eventually. Game is combat? It does. Very very minimal combat. Only when you're in the uh only when you're in the caves. Them caves is God's combats. It's 6.20 p.m. I don't know if I have enough time to go down another five levels. I might just, uh... I might just bail out of here. Oh. You're gonna be like that, are you? Eat it, you jerk. Back to the service. 
Or if you pick a wild farm. I haven't tried those. You know what? I've only ever done the basic farm in this game. All the times that I've played it. Which really, I guess really aren't all that many times. But I've never I've never played anything other than the uh, the basic starting farm. Caves can be dangerous. Make sure you're prepared. Uh, three to seven damage. What do I got here? I got the rusty sword, which does some quantity of damage. To five. Wooden blade is three to seven. Iron dirk is two to four, but it gives plus two crit chance. Knockback, topaz ring, increased weapon precision. I mean, I can't really buy any of this stuff anyway, but that doesn't matter. I don't need to buy things. Come back when you got something to show me, kid. As a drunk. Monster eradication. Help us with our... Keep the valley safe, blah, 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 blah. Skill to get your rewards. So we got... Yeah, we won't be doing much of that. Don't forget the secret forest. There's that too, yeah. All right, head home. Tell the old guy his own hat. <laughs> what? What? Oh, I got a cherry bomb. Eighteen out of a thousand. Yeah, we have a lot of slimes to kill before we can do anything worthwhile with that. It's gonna be just a little bit. Played Animal Crossing. I don't have a Switch. Boop. Uh, that thing. Slimy stuff. Guess I'll keep the algae for eating. What are these other things I can sell? Smelt more copper. Get the wrong button. I'm just gonna sell the cave carrots, I guess. Means that we already got the ones in the community center that we needed. Or the one in the community center, I guess. Uh, take a bit. He's aside. Watering can for the morning. Oh, it's done. Alright, it's faster than I thought it was. Now we're in a chest, a little button on the side that looks like a little house, the red roof will auto stack. Yeah, I'm bad for clicking stuff like that. I think it said sunny again tomorrow. Or no, tomorrow it said like high pollen with light breeze. Yeah, okay. Sleep. Plus one pickaxe proficiency. New recipe crafted staircase. Pretty much no money there. Your progress has been saved. Oh, I missed the... Oh, wait, it's Friday now. Uh, the cart thing in the woods. We gotta go check that. Weather report. Show me rain. Dark. Son of a... Through the TV. That's so upset. Hi, Paul. Is this game 420 friendly? Uh, maybe. I checked my mail too. Oh wait, is there like a like a spring dance or something coming up? Or is that the summer thing? I kinda didn't look at the calendar in town recently. Going on with the mail. I have a request for you. I need fresh cauliflower for a recipe I want to make. Could you bring me one? Sure. 
I've got cauliflower growing. It's gonna be a bit though. I hope she can wait. It's gonna be a slow recipe if she waits on me. How do I not know what season it is? It's spring. I don't know. I'm the guy who always thinks spring goes into winter. <laughs> How can you even ask me that question? Taking forever. So much watering. Who made me plant all these strawberries anyway? I don't know about spring going into winter, but I was uh, in April last weekend. <laughs> What on, bub? Okay, crops are watered again. Oh, my copper bar. Oh wait, what does it take to make the uh? Crap, it takes the ore. Um, well, I probably should have kept some of the ore around. Live and learn, I guess. Live and learn. Uh, let's go visit the uh, the cart in the forest and see if we can buy another one of those rare seeds, maybe. Strawberries give you a lot of experience and money, so it's good. Oh yeah, I planted lots of them. I planted 91 strawberries, so... Should be a decent amount of change we get from it. Just takes a lot of, uh, a lot of watering, because I don't have any sprinklers yet. All right, lady. What do you got? What do you got? Tulips, large mouth bass, coleslaw, melon seeds, kale, large milk. Oh, wait. Do I need to... I think I need a large milk for... Maybe center, don't I? Pumpkin seeds. Oh, there's another rare seed. Oh, we'll get the rare seed. I know I can't get the... Uh, can't get the community center stuff unlocked really fast anyway, so... No, I've got just what you need. Cave carrot. Well, guess what, lady? I don't need your cave carrot. Carrots in my own cave. I do need the milk, but I don't have enough money. Aw. But the seed, it gives more money. Okay, uh, I guess I might as well go back to the mine again. Seen too many reason not to. Go kill more things. Once if I get the copper, I can make another smelter and then uh, smelt things faster. -er. Go milk Marnie. Oh my god. <laughs> Started, inspired you to start playing Stardew Valley again. See, this game's just addictive that way. You see someone else playing it, you immediately want to play yourself. Probably what happened to me. I probably saw, I mean, probably saw someone else playing the game or something. I was like, oh, I should play that again. Bing, bing, level 15. Are you? Get out of here. Ah! 
Oh, your cape grab. That's right. Now you're scared. Oh, don't run away. I'm, I'm not efficient at hitting you this way. That's better. Flatted him good. Dare me to scream chicken nuggets. No, I won't do that. I have uh, kids sleeping upstairs and also my wife. That's not worth it. That's a recipe for disaster. I do really need a better sword. <laughs> the one I have is terrible. <laughs> I just have the rusty sword right now. It's uh, the crummy one. No oh, bueno. I found the ladder like right away. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. We gotta kill those things quick. Oh, no. You're not supposed to kill me. I'm supposed to kill you. Nope. Nope. Don't, don't you molt on me. I hate those stupid flying bugs. Slime. <laughs> Look how long it takes me to kill a slime for crying out loud. Most powerful sword ever. Wait, did I find the stairs right away this time? I think I did. Yeah, there we go. Not the stairs, ladder, whatever. Same thing. Same thing, more vertical. Yeah, waking up a wife by screaming is no one. Yes, definitely not. <laughs> a recipe for uh, a recipe for trouble. Can't dig coal in the ground. I mean, there's you get them from like rocks and stuff, and you can find coal carts in the game sometimes. Coal carts are the best because you get all kinds of coal from them. And lots of rocks, but not a lot else. Back off! I hate these things. Oh, good thing there's not more than one. They're just so time consuming to kill because you hit them and they fly away from you. There we go. Get this. Mine cart there. Hopefully, or a uh, mine track. Hopefully, we can find the cart that has the coal in it. We definitely need coal. Let's we'll take a look before we get on the ladder. Oh, out of here. Ow. Ow. Turn for some reason. There. There it is. Jackpot. Six ten PM. Let's go down the ladder. Put five of those bugs at once attacking you. That's annoying. There's the the one effect or the one event you can get with a swarm kind of thing, but kind of annoying. I just don't like dealing with them at all. Or pain in my butt.
cape carrot. Oh, this is one of those spiral ones. Ah! Back off! Little slime from hell. Did a play through this about a month back. Oh, yeah. One of those games you can just play forever, though. It's never ending. You go season to season or what have you. It's a perennial game. At the what's at the center of this thing. I don't know if I have time though. It's already eight o'clock. Sword upgrade. Feel small sword. So that does four to eight damage versus the two to five. And I get plus two speed. So it's uh it's not the best thing in the world, but it'd be worse. Could be much worse. And we can also fish here too if I had my fishing pole. Bing. You played it for about a year. Oh yeah. The longest I've played this game got me into year two, I think. I always get distracted by other things and then... find myself coming back to games like this later, and then I'm like, Oh, I don't remember what I was doing or where I was. Eh, I'm gonna start over. <laughs> That's exactly what happened again this time. See you, Timothy. Thanks for dropping in. Appreciate the super chat as well. NPM, do you know where your children are? See that? I remember to hit the button that time. Aren't you proud of me? Yeah, I have enough copper and stone to make another one of those things. Another one of these furnace things. I don't have any more copper I can actually smelt, unfortunately. Can I sell the sword? Is that a thing I could sell? Nope. Not here, anyway. Uh, Friday the 19th. Nine days left. I don't know how long it takes the next seeds to grow, but we'll try planting that too, I guess. There we go. Excellent. A little bit of energy left. We can uh, chop a tree down or something. Do you often forget where you are or what you were doing? Um, yes. <laughs> Real life? No, not so much. The issue with it I have is focus. In that what I'm focused on, I have really good retention of. When I'm not focusing on it, it's not it, like it just doesn't recall for me. I'm weird that way. Why well, I have such a hard time remembering birthdays and stuff. I, my brain doesn't do a lot of serving it up for me. It just like if I'm not actively thinking about it. Sleep time. No. Button. 
make everyone proud of me, I'll use the button again. Level 1 combat, plus 5 HP. You could make a sturdy ring if I kept some of those gems that I sold off. Bing, 310 monies. Your progress has been saved. Come on, show me that rain. Give me the rain. Son of a. <laughs> this is the non rainiest spring ever. Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Well, it's a good thing I don't have any geode thing. Oh, oh another. For a second there, I thought the cauliflower was ready, but not so much. Patch notes, rain removed. <laughs> yeah. Turns out we're actually trying to farm in the desert. Who knew? They're like, welcome to farming in Arizona. Look, 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 look. Nearly ready. Yeah, we only got like a so this cauliflower. I don't remember what day we planted it on because it was a reward we got from what's his face Gunther at the museum. Uh, the strawberries should be ready soonish. Also, I think planted them on the thirteenth and the fourteenth. So there were what eight days to grow. There are sprinklers in the game, but you have to be able to make them. So the one sprinkler that I have the ability to make right now is this one here. It only waters the four adjacent tiles, so the cardinal points, north, east, south, and west from the center. Uh, but you need uh, iron bar and copper bar to craft it. I don't have any iron bars because I haven't gone deep enough in the mine to get them yet. There are better sprinklers you can get later that will um, water a larger area than that little sprinkler does. But... I'm I'm willing to make the the crappy ones even <laughs> if I could just uh, just get the stuff I need to make it. Just to save all the effort of all the watering. Chicken statue. I got a chicken statue. All right, we'll take that to Gunther, I guess. Gunther, I got a chicken statue. You know, yeah. Why does the water sound so squishy? I think it's supposed to be the sound of it pouring on the ground, but it's uh, just a sound effect. I don't know. Definitely after you've been listening to it for a couple hours, you you you, really, you kind of need to go to pee a little bit. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit too uh, the uh, the wet noise. What the stuff do I need in that bundle? 99. Oh, I got enough there. Uh, I have enough stone. I don't have enough hardwood yet. Oh, we need the potato. We'll take that. We need the bullhead. We'll take that. All right, set up the community center. Oh, we'll go to Gunther too and give him this. Uh, give him the chicken. Right, the chicken's very scared, or the uh, statue's very scared. It's a chicken statue. You know, people actually worship chickens, uh, if you say so. I mean, I know people worship cows. I haven't heard people worshiping chickens before. Yeah, community center. Oh, we haven't talked to uh, Haley in a little bit either. We should probably do that. 
sure that we're still mildly interested in her romantic attentions. There it is. Bing! I am. Oh, potato. Potato. Oh, uh, it's not the exotic foraging one. Oh, it's this one over here. Construction bundle. Bloop. Bloop. Clap. Good. Can't put it down. There we go. <laughs> like I can't get out of here. Ding, fries are done, ding, fries are done, ding, fries are done, ding, fries are done. Would you like an apple pie with that? All right, come through, let's run it. First, we gotta loot all the garbage cans. I've been to the beach in a few days too. I guess we should go check and see if there's anything down there worth looting. The museum never has anything good in their garbage. God. Chicken statue. Bing. I'm gonna start bringing my fishing pole when I come into town, so if I find myself with time to spare, I can fish without having to run back home. Hey, seriously? Home is she home? He's not. Probably went to the park again. That's all she ever does. Sleeps, hangs out in her kitchen, and goes to the park. Lazy. Actually, did I already talk to her this week? No, oh, still says I need to talk to her. What? Okay. For a second, I thought the hearts went down. <laughs> uh, did you try to play Elder Ring? Believe me, have no death count. Oh, I, I was I am still playing Elden Ring actually. I haven't played it in a few days. I'm gonna have to go back and play it again some more. Uh I have a long way from zero deaths. I think our counter's up to six hundred and something. Six 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 hundred and seventy, six hundred and eighty, some of that. I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Oh wish there was a mall here. God. Sorry, Haley. I don't have a mall. Oh, yeah, I'm stalking her. Totally stalking her. She doesn't like me very much though. So far she hasn't had very kind words to say to me and all she ever does is complain. <laughs> you need to become her sugar daddy. <laughs> Always wanted to be a sugar daddy. <laughs> It was the way, I guess. Already three o'clock in the afternoon. My God, where does the time go in this game? I'll tell you where it goes. It goes fishing. I don't want to go back to the beach and fish at the ocean. There's some ocean fish we need for the community center. But I don't know what season I have to catch them in. I just, I have to catch them. Barely touch the romance in the game. Well, if you get their attentions, you can get them to marry you and then 
Get like a bigger house and... You marry Haley, she verbal abuses you at home instead of having to go to the park to get it. You know. Try giving your spreadsheet to fill out, it hurts lots of math and video games. <laughs> like, huh? Oh, Haley, can you... Can you fit yourself C42? Oh, oh. <laughs> Be sure daddy to hunt someone like Haley sounds like a pain. Yes, it does. I concur. When they divorce you, they take half your strawberries. <laughs> He's like, it was all a ploy to get your strawberries. Maybe a sea cucumber or something? Sardine? Sardine. More bills, divorce, lose half your stuff. Good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Listen, she can take the cat, but she can't take half my strawberries. Is it a mod you have to get in this game to get divorced from somebody? Or is it like uh, something native in the game? I think I saw Dangerously Funny sometime ages ago, like, trying to marry everyone in town. Would have been years ago now, I guess, but... <laughs> That's not a girlfriend, Michael. <laughs> That's other services. After you unlock the witch area, you can divorce. Oh, I see. Pay Lewis 50,000 gold to divorce. Forget it. Once we get hitched, we're staying hitched. Too much money. You must chop down the largest tree in the forest with a heading. Which was half the cat. We'll just keep, you know what, we'll we'll make it a long, drawn-out divorce process, and we'll collect as much cat hair as we can until it equals half the cat in mass, and we'll be fine. Ooh, there's bubbles. The bubbles! More herring. Oh, there's a gold herring. Have a good night, Ashley. Oh, overcast. <laughs> halibut? Got a halibut. Purple. Fancy. Don't do it, fish. Get in my belly. The heck is that? A flounder. Got a flounder. It's starting to feel exhausted. Uh oh. Beeweed. They're right in the bubbles, too. So I discovered a food that after eating causes years of pain and distress. It's called a wedding cake. That's about right. I mean, no, it causes years of bliss and happiness. <laughs> Another halibut. Ah. All fished out. No more bubbles. 
I thought the flounder was something I needed for the community center, but apparently not. Don't worry the halibut. This is the bottom, so both eyes are on the top. Oh, is that not one of the exotic fish ones? Fish and fish bundle. No, I guess not. Tilapia, tuna, and red snapper we need. Eh, alright. See if we can fish by this rock over here. First Mrs. Fox is here about you wooing another girlfriend, and next she's gonna hear you're causing here is a pain. Oh yeah. yeah. She's a good thing she's fast asleep right now. <laughs> Otherwise, I might have years of pain. Cook them? I don't have a kitchen yet in my house in this game. Can't cook anything. Fishy, fishy, fish. Went where I did go. And to keep that, that purple fish we got. The purple herring. Make a wake out of the catter and give it to Mayor Lewis. I didn't even see that message till just now. <laughs> Uh There's fire in the wild. Can I like cook on a campfire in this game? The thing I can do? Like, hey, the campfire cook. <laughs> purple day. Everything's purple today. Ten fifty. I guess I better get my butt back uh, back home so I can sell some stuff. Make sure I don't fall asleep out here in the wild. A bream. So many breams. I was trying to steal from the garbage can. I guess I already did it. The Fox have been watching you a bit due to school almost ending. Wait, HD Blooms. Welcome. Kind of rolled in toward the end of our stream tonight. Double check these things. Make sure that nothing wiggles. Nothing wiggles when I walks. Okay, the, uh, the one helmet we want to keep. The rest of this stuff can go. Flounder. Oh, hold on to the flounder. I don't know what it's for. Or if it's for anything, I mean. We'll stick the halibut the flounder in here. We have newspaper and stuff in here. Yeah. Seaweed. Okay, right, bedtime. Baby sleeps. It's getting late. Go to sleep for the night. Dun dun dun. Uh, it is after midnight my time as well. It's like ten after ten after midnight. I think I'm gonna call it a wrap for tonight. Come back next time. We'll harvest our big uh, first crop of strawberries. We'll be able to get some beans and cauliflower next time as well. We can use those in the community center to knock that out. Hopefully, we'll actually get some rain because that'd be nice. We haven't had a rain day in like forever. And I just want to get my watering can upgraded, but I can't do that if it's going to be out of commission for a couple days. Uh, but uh, thanks everyone for coming and hanging out tonight. I really appreciate it. Uh, I should be live tomorrow night, again, probably around 9 o'clock. Um, I'm leaning towards either playing uh, Elden Ring tomorrow or Grounded. Uh, so I'll decide that at some point tomorrow. Uh, but thank you so much, everyone. Again, I'm as always Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.